match day 12. Underway then at the City Football Academy. Matty Wars trying to win that first challenge. And they've won it well. Here's Batty down the left hand side. The chance has come across. Harrison Park eventually forward then. Travels well with the ball, looking for the through ball. Makassa goes for the lob. And Matty Young has to make the save. Well, it was ambitious, but he's in the goal scoring mood, isn't he? Dubai Mukassi. Lovely spot from Harrison Parker. Somehow beating the back line for Sunderland. Nice little dab over the Thompson on this near side. Now City have to get bodies back. Stood up by Jacob Wright. Watson twisting, turning, gets the slip. Just trying to feed that one across. Batty is back in there helping out for City. Needs to be careful with the challenge. Well, the shot comes through. Josh Robertson taking up a central position. It's out with Ashton Muir. He's got Seb Naylor on his left shoulder. Here is Naylor. Warhurst in the middle. Comes to the near post. Fapetu with the switch ball out to Farid Ruprecht. Jacob Wright on the overlap. Now the ball needs to be good. Into the danger area. They're looking for the cutback here. Well, were... That's all right, Jay. Watson continuing his run. Keeps going and keeps going and Watson gets his shot away in the end forcing the attack Ashton Muir offering some support here he is the captain Muir there's the ball across but it's straight into the arms of Matthew Young so free kick to Sunderland it's a bit of a sighter but it forces the save from Jack Wint let's start a Jacob Wright continuing his run. Well, it's just opened up for City's number two. Left footed strike, but no real conviction to ever trouble Matthew Young, who makes a comfortable save. But Jacob Wright taking up a good position. Parker with the ball, and the fullback cuts into a central position. Left footed strike, but comfortable in the. Who finds Robertson? Always well, looking for a through run of Rig. Watson. Watson. Shapes to shoot, gets his shot away, right-footed, and Jack Wint saving down to his right, makes the save. Well, Tom Watson has proved a useful out ball for Sutherland, two goals so far in the league. Cuts onto his right, gets his shot away. Ben Creamer it was who went to ground, challenge came in from Seb Naylor, Ashton Muir with the ball across, here's Patty with the chance deflected, and it will run for a corner. Well, Dan Batty... His eyes must have lit up here looking for his first goal in the league. That's the free kick that Sunderland were asking for, not given. Seb Naylor continued, so to Ashton Muir. Batty, look out for the number eight here, working his way into the box, but the final touch came off. Cleared by Mufuni, but only as far as Chris Rigg as the referee, Aaron Williams, blows for half-time. And the tail of the tape, no breakthrough here at the City Football Academy on match day 12. The two best chances. City's first, Divine Mukasa looking for the speculative, ambitious lob over the top of Matthew Young. Bull in second place with victory over the Merseysiders in the league last time out. Two points now separating those, but there's still a bit of work to do to claw that gap or give it away. Here's a chance for Sutherland, and they will score, and it's Ben Creamer. So Sutherland take the lead, given away at the back. And a couple of minutes in after the restart, Manchester City now chasing this game. The Black Cats have the lead. For Petu it was, looking for the switch ball to Stephen Mafuni. But it's a blind pass and it's allowed Ben Creamer to get his second in Premier League North so far this season. City with themselves to blame. And they are now behind at the City Football Academy. Manchester City nil. Farid Ruprecht to Divine Mukasa. And now Ashton Muir, Seb Naylor making the run on his left shoulder. Here is Seb Naylor. There's the ball in. And City get the equaliser. Well, they are back on terms. And it's Farid Ruprecht who's got the goal. Great work from the Germany-born youngster, cutting in from that right-hand side and read the situation. And Sutherland's lead is short-lived. Farid Ruprecht, who's got the goal, coming into the near post area. The move beats Sutherland. Look out for Seb Naylor making the overlapping run, spotted by Ashton Muir. And Farid Ruprecht turning that ball beyond Matthew Young for an equaliser.
Manchester City 1, Sunderland 1. Keeping hold of the ball, but Farid Ruprecht does well. Robertson with the ball in, headed away initially. Now a chance for Rig, maybe shaped to shoot, and he has scored. Sunderland go back in front. Well, it was Watson who kept the ball alive over on that far side. Then Robertson, who does well to stand this ball up. Headed away initially by Seb Naylor. But Chris Rigg with the initial feint and then gets the shot away to make it Manchester City 1, Sunderland 2. Now, Thurry Ruprecht. Oh, it's a good run from the Germany youngster. Keeps going, he's into the box. Can he get his shot away? He does, oh, and having done all the hard work, Farid Ruprecht can't work the target, but they will get a corner out of this. Terrific burst of acceleration from the former Hamburg Academy prospect on target already this afternoon. Seb Naylor, Akasa again. Akasa with the ball in. Well, the header came in at the near post area from uh, Matty Warhurst. Couldn't find the target. Maybe the angle a little bit against him as well. Casa with the ball in. And now Farid Ruprecht. Does he fancy his chances here against Joseph Neald? Into the feet of Batty, who's immediately on the half turn and he's stood up by Bell. There's the ball. Oh, missed. Just somehow Matthew Young losing the flight of that. Seb Naylor trying to keep it alive. Doesn't need to give away. To Struck. Lavery's up there. Lavery with the strike. And it just. They really have applied themselves well. Noggin Sui might be in here. Can he get his shot away? Sutherland won the penalty. And it's going to be a penalty. Yeah, I think he's given it. He has given it, yeah. It's the foul on Ogunsui. Here we go again. Mifuni it was who makes the challenge. Yeah, initial contact on the left foot, wasn't it, from Huey. Short run up. Referee sets. Ogunsui steps up. And he has scored. He sends Jack Wint the wrong way. And suddenly go 3-1 up in this game. And Ogunsui, having won the penalty has converted from the penalty spot to make it Manchester City 1, Sunderland 3. Calm, composed finish from the spot from Sunderland's number 9. His second in the league so far this season, sending Jack Wint the wrong way. Manchester City 1, Sunderland 3. Here's Ruprecht. Trying to find the cutback. I think Sunderland. Brooklyn, Nafonkiu. Chance to get this ball in. Stood up by Ogun Siri, centre forward, playing left back at the minute for Sunderland. Divide Mukasa. Get him out! Mukasa, Mukasa hangs the ball up. Well, Farid Ruprecht was in there, but the Sunderland um, defender got the last touch on it, so it will be a Manchester City corner. Watson for Sutherland. Sutherland suddenly pouring bodies forward here. August Hughes is coming into that near post there. He might get the final touch on this. And how has that stayed out? Goodness me, August Hughes looking for his second of the game. Here we go again. Sutherland pouring bodies forward. Watson ball into the near post area. August Hughes was in there. It's his second touch. Oh dear, oh dear. Lavery to Chung. Now Rig. Watson looking for the give and go. Watson. Shot blocks. Good challenge by Harrison Parker. And on the follow up, West rattled the woodwork. It might be Joseph Neal coming onto it. Ivan. Ivan. Yes. The referee blows for the full time whistle as Manchester City under 18s. Fall to only a second defeat in Premier League under 18 North this season. And the surprise here is that Sutherland collects only a second win on the road.